The fighting may be over, but there are still U.S. troops in Iraq, and one of the key brigades there is from Texas. Lana talks with Brigadier General Stephen Sanders about his division's work in Iraq and the status of the efforts to rebuild. General, your 36th Infantry Division of the Texas Army National Guard has quite a history. Well, our division uh, was actually had an opportunity to uh, serve both in World War One and World War Two, and now uh, this is a major deployment uh, for the division headquarters, and we currently are the uh, headquarters element for southern Iraq, which is a fair piece of real estate. It's about the size of the uh, state of uh, Wisconsin. What are the skill sets of the Guard, and how is it being utilized there in Iraq? We have a full-time force, but we also have what we call traditional end day, mobilization day soldiers, farmers, teachers, city engineers. Uh, I myself work for the electric uh, power company up in the Dallas, Texas. Skills valuable in environments like this. What is the status of the rebuilding underway in Iraq, General? They're aggressively pursuing uh, their infrastructure build-out specifically uh, for uh, electricity and uh, their uh, industrial base to include oil and gas. Uh, there are several international companies over here currently trying to assist with the nation of, of Iraq to uh, rebuild their economic base. You have had several fascinating tours of duty. How does this particular tour compare to the previous Previous ones for you. I get a lot of personal satisfaction now seeing the improvement in the quality of life of the Iraqis over here and the, their, their democracy is uh, developing. I was here six years ago actually and I can tell you there's a marked improvement uh, in uh, the activity. Uh, people are, are uh, able and willing to uh, speak their mind and uh, it's just a quality of life has improved over here and, and the Iraqis uh, recognize that and they can tell that their situation is improved. Well thanks so much Brigadier General Stephen Sanders there from Iraq.